here we go. Welcome back to Amateur Dota 2 League Season 3, Dire Game Bayon. 2 for Xenodoc Kyle versus Special Tactics of Dota. And um, first game went to the way of Xeno, I believe, Radiant thanks to the Tinker getting a ton of farm as well as um, Tidehunter. Dyer's ban. So the bans from the first game carry on with Lycan and Ember Spirits and um, I think we will see a Tinker yeah. on Special Tactics of Dota side ban. if I'm not mistaken. But nope, they just go for Dyer's a usual pick. Invoker uh, Invoker ban and on the Xeno side we have an Assassin ban for their last ban for first phase banning. Zeno might want to try Ten out seconds to go. a bristle back to tank Radiant's everything, pit. but looks like they're going for that ancient apparition again. Worked so well for the first game. Why not use it again? If it isn't broke, don't fix it. Call of Duty style. And uh, Timbersaw is picked off Radiant's pit. on special tactics of Dota as Dyer's well as Mirana. Go they're going for Mirana again. I t well. If it's broke, then fix it, but Mirana wasn't particularly very good on the first game. She was pretty bad on the first game. Um, it was probably they weren't really using her to the fullest potential. Uh, maybe because it was a stand-in and not the usual seconds to go. teammate that they played with them. That's probably why they Dyer's go for man. Picking her basically, and we have a visage picked up on Xeno side and a Bane being Radiant's banned ban. again on Xeno. I think that was a waste of a ban because if uh, they really want the ban, if they re they really wanted Bane, ban. they would have gotten Bane on the first two picks. Life Sealer, Slark, pick. and Shadow Demon are the band are banned on the second phase of bans from their teams respectively, and there is no sign of Pug, uh, Pugna, Tinker, or Nature's Prophet on any of these teams. Lich is picked up Dyer's as pick. a support character on Special Tactics of Dota Radiant side. Ten seconds to go. Five seconds. Reserve time. I think they're using their reserve time Going very well. Radiance pick. Lone Druid is picked up by Xeno, looking for a late game potential with that uh, bear. Ten seconds to go. Five seconds. Five seconds. Reserve time. Luna. Luna is picked up as their carry Dyer's of pick. choice on the special tactics of Dota side. We'll see who will be there carry on Xenocide, they could actually opt in and go for another support if they so please because Visage uh, can play you know holes but they really need a tank and a proper middle on Xeno Dire side. 10 seconds to go and uh, this is game Five two. Seconds. First game went the way of Xeno 
Radiance Ban. Dyer's Ban. Ten seconds to go. Five seconds. Radiance pick. Rubik. Rubik being picked up Dyer's for the last pick. pick on the Dota special tactics of Dota side as well as uh, as well as Zeno picking up Brewmaster for their specialty carry. They will probably pick out a mid hero, I'm guessing, on their on the of the, of the last pick and it could ten be seconds to go. Anybody Zeus. but uh, they, they pick up Zeus. Very uh, very support like hero, but um, if he gets Fed early on, he will become a carry himself. He is very squishy, but uh, with the uh, squishy part, he already already has a ton of damage. All right, let's start off on the radiant side. It is STD special. Um, tactics of Dodo is not the disease that you're thinking about. It is Art on Luna, Slice on Mirana, Vulcanas on Lich Panic on Timsa, Neko Sama on Rubik. Let's go on the Dire side. Dire side, it is Arf on Ancient Apparition 0 0.5 on Lone Druid, Pita Jung Kicks on Zeus, Cleek Cleeks on uh, Brewmaster and Sokasa on Visage. Looks like Laundred will be... I don't know what he's doing. I was going to say uh, they would level 1 Roche, but it doesn't look like they will um, actually commit to that. And here is the first puzzle of the game going for the Rubik. Probably uh, a little tactical. Game is resumed and looks like Radiant Side is uh, looking for other players at this point. And here we go. So that's a pretty good relief on Mirana's side that um, wound shall be deep. Th that they're not uh, level one rushing. But uh, double one. damage goes for Lone Druid. Look at that bear! Look at that bear! Look at that bear! Pulling in that creep wave like a boss. They won't do anything at all. He can't damage these um, heroes, but in the end, it won't do anything to him at all. He will just probably lose a little bit more, a little bit of health. Let's see, backlash, it's 100, not a lot, come on. It's not even one third of his health or, or, or a quarter. So, very early on, tower is being damaged very well macro by Lone Druid on his part. A 
that say kills and deaths and assists. There is nothing yet less it's and denies is what I really want to see. Let's see what else is happening. Trialing top, Brewmaster, Ancient Apparition, and Visage against a solo Timbersaw, Metal Zeus against uh, Mirana. Surprise, I thought that would be Rubik. Lich Rubik and uh, what's his face is on bottom, that is Luna. Trilaning against a lone druid with his bear. I guess he's not that lone at all. He sent the bear to the fountain to get healed up. He doesn't want that backlash 100 damage going back to him. But if you look at Mirana, he's all, uh, she's already down by uh, Zeus's probably Lightning Bolt doing a ton of damage. And here's an Invisibility Rune by Visage will uh, Mirana. Whoa, oh, oh, nice. Denying Mirana to get that bottle refreshing charges. Looks like Brewmaster is getting a ton of farm here against Timbersaw, who got no last hits at all. No last hits. But looky here, Rubik and Lich <laughs> spotted right away, and Zeus, Zeus sees them actually. Zeus can see him from that ward right here. Uh, uh, uh. And uh, he's leaning to the right of the, or to his left. <sighs> it looks like that won't do anything at all. But uh, 100 damage will be taken by, uh, looks like, nope, Lone Druid will get his bear back. That is a big ass sword on Brewmaster. I really like that cosmetic item. Let's see, it is called Words of the Drunken Warlord. Lich is trying to go on Lone Druid, but the bear is kind of <laughs> helping him out. But looks like he is caught on by Rubik and dropping down to a 250-90 right now. Ooh, 51 Don't hit away, and here it. comes uh, Lich getting brave. that last hit. And uh, that will award him with a 400, uh, above 400 gold for that last, um, for the first blood. Very well played by him. Lone Trade got a little cocky. He got a little cocky and he paid the price for, for doing that. Middle is missing. Looks like middle is missing, says Mirana, but I think she is a little blind because Zeus is right there and they already have a freaking ward right here, so I don't know what the fuss is about. Ancient Apparition picks up Timber Salt on the top, which I have missed. I am very sorry about that. Radiant's top tower has taken hits. Radiant's gone and fortified their structures. Radiant's top tower is in bad shape. Radiant's top tower is hurting. Read 
regeneration. Looks like they really want to get this tower down, but it's like TP comes in from Lich. Uh, he's not level 6 yet, so he can't use... Um, he can't use the frost chain. The chain frost. <laughs> Hannah Minus finished on Luna. You don't really see Luna getting a Hannah Minus uh, at first. But I guess uh, they are thinking about the late game potential of, uh, of their heroes. Up on top, Timbersaw dies. Uh, to ancient Apparition and Visage also. Uh, I'm missing everything. I'm sorry. I get. I gotta focus Radiant's now. Top All right. Looks like Rubik is spinning out of control. Out of. Uh, anybody got a? What do they have? Nothing too much going on. Just bottom tower uh, toward the bottom lane. Luna got picked off by Lone Druid. That will give him uh, more. Will give him more Radiant farm. swooped in and disowned their top tower. And Rubik actually denies that first tower, tier 1 tower, which is a very good deny. They only get about 100 gold instead of uh, 200 to 400. Spear Bear also getting an orb Radiant's of venom to slow down and do extra right more damage. Look at that. Visage down to 160 health, 100 health, 50 health. One more right click. Nope. Runner will just uh, scooch away from that. Salve comes and helps to Visage to uh, get in 400 extra more HP. But look at what Luna is doing. Luna is uh, trying to farm up, trying to uh, trying to get his boots in. Well, he can he she can actually afford one boot. Boot speed, and here goes. Is already eight minutes and we have five kills so far. Zeno are looking pretty good. I like how Timber Saw and Brewmaster are staying in their lane and farming more. Middle is missing. And uh, their supports are actually doing most most of the rotation wise, but I think uh, uh, Luna and uh, Tim saw so rotation would help them a missing. little just to uh, freshen up a few things, or or at least Luna going top to help out Tim saw to clean up a few of those kills. Trilin is back on the top from Dire side, but uh, that will force off Timbersaw back to his creep wave. The Dire best do something about that bottom tower. Visage will TP bottom to help out so their uh, defend to defend that bottom tier one. That will actually push off all the way to the tower. That, uh, they're not playing. It doesn't look confident on the STD part. They they don't look comfortable. They don't act comfortable. If they were really comfortable, then they would have actually went in and um, tried to go in. Look at that room master activating TP. <laughs> Stun goes into uh, Rubik and Rubik goes so down to room master. And it looks like they're going to get that tower very very easily comfortably and uh, Luna is just bottom tower better days. there are tons of there are there uh, goes about Radiant's four bottom tower. five uh, around so Go now they're the TPing mode. top and Timbersaw gets picked off in Ancient Average I missed that last second I'm 
missing a ton of ton of kills this game. Radiance mid tower is getting banged up. Let's look at items real quick. We have Visage finishing off. Radiance mid tower. Or trying to finish hand. off a um, a mech. Laundred already finished the trank boots on himself, so that's Radiance he's all set. Coming apart. Uh, Visage also picks up a medallion of courage, so he will probably go for the uh, mech next. Um, Ancient Apparition is sitting in with just one arcane. Arcane boots are also on Zeus and a bottle. Brewmaster already has a blink down light. It's a very good, very good item. Uh, Luna has the power treads, Hannah Minus uh, Wraith Band. Bottle finished up on Mirana as well as Phase Boots. So Mirana is looking better from the last game, but um, she seriously needs more farm to be. To be looking more or better, but look at Tibisaw solo laning five levels done. Look, he is on par with his own support team, and his farm isn't far apart from Rubik, who's also another support team. Tibisaw is not looking well at this point, he's not farmed up to a level that you want a Tibisaw to be farmed up. He really gets to shine after he gets his Bloodstone. Looks like uh, I believe Zeus was disconnected for a second and uh, he's still disconnected and reconnect now. All right, carry on. Looks like they're going to push down the middle tower light just like how they did Radiant's in the first game. They up. Go to one tower, get it, move on to the next tower, get that one, move on to the next tower. They go by tower, by tower, by tower. Radiance they don't ambush anybody unless they really, really want to, unless they're very farmed as Luna or Mirana. They don't want to go after them. They want to get the towers, they want to finish the game as fast as possible, and they really, really use that gold advantage to themselves. Even if the XP are dead on, they are balanced, Gold defense makes a ton of difference. Just missing the mark on that one, and look, Lone Druid just getting him more farm and farm and farm and farm. He has finished, let's see, a hand of Midas. Everybody's getting a hand of Midas these days, I don't know why. I would have uh, preferred seeing a Radiance on the Lone Druid Bear, but uh, apparently that's not. That's not what they really want to get. And will we see a denial of this tower, the middle tower? Not enough damage done to it yet to be denied. I believe it's 140 to deny the tower. The Looks like there's a rotation the top tower. on. Oh, it's caught. It's caught. Here comes the bear. He didn't TP the bear. That's that's very odd. Dyer's top towers getting Here comes down. the bear. They see the bear. They are looking for Wait a way to initiate, but looks like they're just gonna go for the tower. Just get the tower, down. and here comes the first station. Just in time, Zeus comes in with the ult to pick off Rubik. And Timbersai is trying to get away, but that won't happen. Vicious will pick off Timbersai, and Moonlight's, uh, Moonlight's Shadow will actually make sure the safety of the other three remaining Radiant players. Arrow lands on Brewmaster, but uh, that won't do anything because there is nobody to follow up on the damage. Lich gets owned Somebody by I Witness Mad, and uh, Lone Tree picks up Rubik. I think that's uh, that's what that's what happened. 
Oh, this busy tech. <laughs> friend. Here comes uh, Eclipse by Luna getting nobody and he just feeds Visage. Not looking good at all. Look at it. 1 and 11. Uh oh. Timbers are getting a little, little aggressive. Zeus dropping to 100. Brewmaster dropping to 150. Very, Guess very aggressive. If he pulled up on that, he might have gotten at least two kills off there. Having trouble seeing straight. Oh, look, the bear is still going right away. Let's look at the XP grab right now. It's 5,000 leading the way of Xeno. And on the gold grab, it is almost 750 on um, 7.5k on Xeno's side. Looking like the first game, except with a lot less kills on the special tactics. So Dota side, the Radiant side. The game one again went on the way of Dire um, Xeno. And looks like they are going to. Make it two for two in this game. <laughs> Very bad micromanagement by Visage Goodbye. on the familiars, not stunning Mirana at all. Let's look at this Luna. Is she farmed up? I would say no. I would say she is not farmed at all. That uh, hand of minus will come in handy, but look at that. Green Monster comes in with the blink. And. Laundry got the kill. That's very odd. I thought Zeus would have handled that. But uh, Laundry is bare in a pretty and tagging right claws. Sets up the pretty much um, kill for everybody. Here's the gang, all smoked up, trying to go in on this bottom tower, and a drunken haze is stolen by Rubik. Not looking very good on Rubik, and he lost it because he just died. Look at that ancient apparition going in with the a last one. Lich comes in with that ulti and going on everybody imaginable, but it's not looking good because those uh, illusions of the so what is it called? Element sessions, hey, are uh, tanky enough to actually Radiant's bottom tower seen better days. Tank in some of that um, damage. Radiant lost one of them bottom towers. Blumas is trying to get the Agnum Scepter so that uh, he can increase the duration of the oh, Maelstrom is finished on Lorn Druid, probably going to grab there because what else can it go for? And uh, if you look at SDD, it's on the same spot again. It is defending, it is not committing to do any one thing. And I believe that is Luna. Yes, that is Luna. Just farming away, trying to farm quietly so that she can actually get something. But let's look at hero level. It is. Jesus. It's looking bad on the Radiant side. Let's look at the items before they initiate. Uh, Mirana has written on a BKB. Luna, I have no idea, already has the Hand of Midas uh, Helmolder Dominator and a uh, Power Treads. Looks like Lich doesn't even have any mana, any kind of boots. It's just uh, the Boots of Speed, the boots, the regular one. Timberside getting an arcane, and those are the only things that are on Radiant side. Ancient Apparition picking up an urn. Um, Ancient actually goes on a lone druid, so that the bear can live again, I guess. Um, let's see. Brewmaster getting that Agnum Scepter finished finally, and uh, this is just finally working on that. Mechanism. 
since uh, the ex Xeno has finished their Radiance Mid Tower could use a hand. Finished the the Roshan and they already have the, the Aegis. They will so be pushing on a bit more aggressive than before. So look at that. They're just going for a straight to the tier three. They don't care what else is going on. And I believe Laundry will Somebody's cooking. Yes, go down by Zeus will pick up Lich and Pacific will Jesus Zeus with a double kill. Trying to call on Timbersaw right now. Timbersaw barely escaping with 60 HP. And his Oh Timbersaw picks up Zeus before he dies long. Radiance mid towers get five in a row. So Lone Druid picks up uh, Luna right after he gets back to life by the Aegis and Brewmaster is trying to pick up some slack and uh, push more to the tower, but look at that. Watch your step. Very it's nice play by Tinsaw and Rubik to step in and get the kill. So right now they're on the counter push. They really need to put they really need to get a tower to um, to <laughs> stand out and say we are still in the game. We are still we are still a um an opponent, I should say. Okay. And here comes the bear. I think Mirana will be... Oh, just missed that barely. Mirana trying to go back again on that bear this time. If I get the bear, get the actual... Get the actual lone druid. Look at that, Visage picking off Timbersaw, just like that, well, big credits goes to Zeus with that ulti. And Luna is still farming away, has a thousand gold. I don't, I think that hand of mine is kind of, was a bad situation on that. Zeus gets Mirana this time and Brewmaster will pick up Lich. Radiance top tower is taking hits. There goes the top tower. Radiance top towers. The Radiant got one last top tower. Timbersaw is not looking good at all. He's working or trying to work on the the Bloodstone, but it won't be enough. He doesn't have a ton of mana pool, and Rubik will actually go down to Visage as they are pushing down to the top tower. Luna actually split pushes and gets one tower. Um, you might actually see a Rat Dota at this point, and um, they're not they're not fortifying yet. Here comes the fortification. Uh, looks like uh, she TP back. Here comes the Roommaster with the ultimate, going split tower. three, and Luna getting caught. Somebody's on a radio This is the soul assumption blowing off. This is getting a double kill, getting Lich, and Lich's ulti is spinning off of everybody. But that won't get uh that won't, that won't get a kill. Timbersaw getting ancient apparition in that point and Zeus clean off Timbersaw. Timbersaw will buy back, however, and a GG is called beforehand to uh, finish off the game right there so that is a 2-4 nothing on Xeno side uh, the dire side I should say uh, they are winning both the two games that they have played and that will be the end of the series we will probably have more games tonight uh, I won't be casting them but uh, fellow other casters and other teams will be playing them I hope you enjoyed watching the game I enjoyed casting and uh, you all have a good one thanks for watching again